Morning guys, it's Farmer Richard here from Lower Drayton Farm. It's six o'clock in the morning on Sunday, the 18th of December. I cannot believe it is Christmas in one week time, guys. Awesome. It's also the World Cup today as well, so that's exciting. But I thought I'd record this little video for you. It's a slightly different video, but I just want to show you a few of the things that we've been up to and a little surprise that we've got for Farmer Ray going on for Christmas. Let's go. So it's a cold, frosty morning. And you might wonder, where is Farmer Richard today? Well, here I am at the gates of our local Massey Ferguson dealership, KO Machines. Fantastic local family business who we get on really, really well with. And you all know how much, every, well, Myself and Farmer Ray love Massey Ferguson's. So I'm just waiting for one of the family, Jack, to come and we'll show you the next part of the surprise, guys. So for Christmas this year, Farmer Ray is getting a brand new Massey Ferguson tractor. Look at that, guys. Got all the logos and the detailing on as well. He doesn't actually know anything about it. And Jack is now delivering it up to Liverpool, where tonight there is a farmer um, trapped to run around Liverpool city centre, raising money for Audley Hay Children's Hospital and local food banks. So this is what farmers do. They put lights on their tractors and they drive them around the city and it raises lots of money for charity. Farmer Ray thinks that he is going to Liverpool to watch the tractor run. Little does he know that he's actually going to be driving that beast of a tractor. We'll keep the updates going, guys. So why have we bought a new tractor? Well, this is the first new tractor that we've bought since 1995. So I think it was about time we had a new one. Um, Farmer Ray is 70 years old as well. Most people are retired by the age of 70. So if Farmer Ray can't have a new tractor at that age, well, there must be something wrong because he is showing no sign of retirement and we wouldn't want that either as long as he's happy. And finally, this tractor is a very iconic tractor. It's been wrapped for Massey Ferguson on behalf of a lad called Stu uh, and it was basically to celebrate the Queen's Jubilee this, this uh, spring and this summer and it's travelled all around the UK it's also celebrating 100 years, well, 150 years of Massey Ferguson. And we all know how much Farmer Ray loves Massey Ferguson. But here is Rapper Stu to tell you more. Hi guys, I'm Rapper Stu. Um, behind me here, we've got a very special and iconic tractor. So this tractor, personally myself, um, I've wrapped this for Massey Ferguson UK. This was done for the Queen's Jubilee, so it's one off, it's one special tractor. And as you can see, Farmer Ray has now owns this tractor, as well as play at Lower Dragon Farm. So this tractor is going to be staying local within the Staffordshire community, which is absolutely great. So what I want you to do is come down to Lower Dragon Farm and come see this very, very special tractor. It's such an iconic tractor that Master Ferguson have also created a model of the tractor that's been on sale this year. And how cool is that? I would personally like to say a massive thank you to Massey Ferguson for helping me with this. KO Machines have been absolutely awesome. Of course, Rapper Stu, um, the NFU have been on, in on this as well. And I'm sure there's a few too many more to mention as well, but it's been a great surprise. And let's see how the story unfolds. So guys, it is midday on Sunday. And Farmer Ray's good friend, Roger, has come to pick him up to take him to the tractor run. Again, he thinks that he's just going with Roger to watch the tractor run. But the reason Roger's come to see me as well is because I've got the keys for this new tractor as well that they're going to be driving. So here you go, Roger. Here's, here's the okay, keys for that brand new 8S. Yeah, it's very difficult to keep this a secret from him, so he'd be, I think he'd be swearing time we get up to the <laughs> side. How many times has Farmer Ray pulled your leg over the years? Oh. 500 or more. 500 or more, so. It'd be yeah. nice to get one back on him. <laughs> it's our own chance to get the back on him, so. Hopefully, we'll give you some more updates as we go. Um, but yeah, basically, Farmer Ray and Roger are driving up to Liverpool and they're going to go and jump on that new tractor. 
enjoy okay yeah well actually the other thing i want to say is part of this tractor and it's set up by a guy called ollie ollie blogs he's a farmer does a lot of youtube and i know roger you and dad watch ollie as well he does lots of charity work yeah, and does yeah. great work doesn't he yeah he, he, i think the the money he raises for this charity tractor run is enormous yeah exactly it's fantastic i think maybe in the future they could do a tractor run maybe in london for st Albans street uh, children's hospital or maybe in birmingham for birmingham children's hospital all in ollie's name but uh, let's see how today goes Cheers. Enjoy. Okay, then. Well, guys, I'm still at the play barn because it's one of our busiest days for Christmas. We've had a great day, but I've just received a telephone call from Farmer Ray. Very shocked, very happy, and very excited to be driving this new tractor. I don't think he realises that we've actually bought the tractor yet, but we can sort that out tomorrow. Um, but all we'd like to say is any of our customers, we know a lot of you do actually travel down the M6 from Liverpool. If you're in that area tonight, Go and support this tractor run for Audley Hay Children's Hospital and the food banks. And you might see Farmer Ray and Farmer Roger on the tractor together. We wanted to post this video this evening so you could all watch it and spread a bit of festive cheer, guys, and a bit of fun. And we'll try and get some more photos of the actual tractor run with everybody else tomorrow or going on this week. Um, also, follow Ollie Blogs on YouTube as well. Look at all the great work that he does. Um, and the tractor should be back home by about Wednesday and we're going to park it outside the play barn for the rest of the week with all the lights on. So again, just spread in a bit of festive cheer. But thank you very much for watching and we'll post more videos like this in 2023.